think of last year, it, uh, the expectations was very high, and uh, there was a, a, a you and you uh, saw that. we had camps in in, in all twelve. Last yeah, well, I think it's a very yeah, it's actually a difficult question because uh, it's unfair towards some of the players that maybe was selected uh, to to talk about that. I always believe that we should pick a, go a team uh, and players that is informed. And at the moment I can say that the team that we have picked is the 28 players that's in form. Uh, maybe there's one or two guys out there that might uh, be, feel themselves unlucky because of injuries. Uh, super rugby players are available to us. Jan Sarfontein is in the team at the moment, so it's Peterson, we've picked him. So uh, uh, Jason Colby was on the bench the other day for the Stormers, so they are all in the team. And uh, so yeah, I think we get, got very close to the, the ideal team that we wanted to pick. And like I said, the pl players that we've picked is the guys that is in form at the moment. Um, no, it's a great honour being being selected once again. I think um, yeah, I think uh, it's it's been a good, it's been a good preparation for us uh, so far this, for this year for this World Cup. I think uh, after last year's success, the nation's expecting quite a lot of us. But I think we can step up and we can make them proud once again. Um, no, I'm very happy. Um, an honour to be in the team. I mean, it's always it's always a privilege to be to be chosen for um, for your country. And um, no, we think we I think we got a really strong team um, to go defend the title in France. It's a big honour, and um, I think uh, a lot of guys um, would have played would like to play in this team. And yeah, I just think you should yeah grab every opportunity and make uh, make it count. Firstly, this is a huge opportunity for me as player. And there's a lot of players out there that would love to be in this position where I am. So for me, I'm just going to grab this opportunity both ends and make the best use of this opportunity as well. And give the best of my ability. Oh, well, last year, uh, that was exactly the, the way we th the thinking were going. Like, uh, we know that it was going to be wet in South Africa. This time around, it's a total different situation. And we had to... Uh, maybe look at a game plan that will suit that situation and that uh, the surface we're going to play on and the, and, and the climate that we're going to play in. And it's the same for the players and the personnel that we've picked for the site. So uh, the big challenge was, and still is, to get to that right blend of play uh, that will suit this team and to bring the talent to, uh, to the forward uh, the best. Um, France, uh, it's going to be it's going to be nice. Uh, I heard we're playing there in the summer in the in the south of France, so it's going to be nice and dry um, um, field, so we can we can give the ball some air. We can play a bit more expansive than last year here in in the winter, and I think yeah, it's going to be it's going to be a great a great World Cup. I think um, I think this uh, Southern Hemisphere teams are going to be uh, dominant once again. If I look at the sides from New Zealand and Australia, they've got some some world class players there, so I'm looking forward to it. I think it will definitely be a bit more difficult than it was last year. Um, because it's um, overseas in France, we we also got a bit of a tough pool um, playing England and the uh, host nation France. So um, yeah, no, it's it's definitely going to be a bit more difficult, but we up for the challenge. It's going to be tough, definitely, but um, we have a great team, great players, and I believe with um, great preparation. Now this month uh, we can pull it through and just work hard, and yeah, it will all pay off. Yeah, we're defending champions. It's a huge, huge task for us as a World Cup squad going to France to represent the Under-20 World Cup again. But we must, as a group as, and individuals, look at what we have to focus on and play as a team and the result will come our way. Now you see, that's the one thing about uh, age group rugby. You start over again. Although we are the world champions of 2012, this is a brand new beginning. It's a new year. And the team that will go over there is uh, a new team. So uh, there, is, there, there are guys in the team, uh, Jan Serfontein, Andre Pollard, that's been there last year. Marvin Ori, who, who, who broke his leg, unfortunately, would have been the third guy in the, in the team that, that's been to the last year's World Cup. But, uh, you know, tremendous uh, experience from Jan and, and, and Andre coming to the, uh, that, that they are bringing to this team. And uh, we are looking forward for some new stars to be born in this uh, JWC in, in France. And uh, maybe next year there's, there's another Jan Serfontein or Pollard coming to the forefront.